I'm here today to tell you about my new line of seasonings. We've got you covered from seafood, to the smoker, to the grill, to roasting, the sweet, the savory, the umami. We've got the balance the whole way across the board. While they're designed specifically for wild game, you know each and every one of these is going to be great on domestic poultry, beef, pork, lamb, anything that you would normally cook at home. You can find all these Hunt Chef Eat What You Kill seasonings in the store online at HuntChef.com. Follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and my new Hunt Chef YouTube channel. Stay tuned, a lot more coming for Hunt Chef Nation. Hey, we're excited to be here in Northwest Missouri with our main man, Big Bill, Twisted Oak Hunts. I don't know about you guys, but I'm excited to lay down uh, Big Missouri Monarch. Thanks so much for being here. Thanks awesome meeting you. Jay, what do you think, got in your hand, buddy? I think, the rut's, I think the rut's on a roll here, and I'm excited for the week because we just got done in Kansas yesterday. And when he says we, he means him. Yeah. I got done in Kansas yesterday. <laughs> I didn't get to Kansas. Uh, and I, I tell you, the rut, we watched it pick up during the week. You know, it went from peak pre-rut to hit the scrapes to where they were just rolling. Two days ago, round nine in the tree, my camera ran, saw seven bucks and three shooters. And we closed the deal on the last morning the hunt. Chef, I was texting you the night before. Yeah. It was kind of epic because I was like, dude, we, you know, busted our tails here. Bottom of the ninth, two outs. That's right. Bottom of the ninth, two outs, rehanging sets for three days and got one in the last two hours that we were going to be in Kansas. Um, so here in Missouri, I, I expect us to hit the rut just right. Really excited to have Miss Sadie Bass in house. Thanks for joining us, my friend. Yes, thanks for um, I'm sure everybody gets sick of watching Chef and I's ugly mugs. Um, so we really appreciate you showing up so people want to watch. <laughs> you just get to listen to my bad interviews instead. Yeah. All the chaos in the blind. So you grew shop. up you grew up hunting where? In Michigan. Nice. And you, yes. you've always hunted with your dad, family tradition, kind of like Chef yes. and I do on the show, right? Yeah, for sure. And Colby, tell us a little bit about your hunt tonight. So he came out, well there's a small eight point that ran out, and then I'm sitting there and it was getting just before dark, and then he stops out. I already got the shakes and everything going on, and I was like, okay, I'm doing it, I'm doing it. So I was trying to get the film going, because I was self-filming, and... Which is so hard to do, people yeah, don't know how hard that is. Yeah, it's terrible, and then, so I had the gun right in the corner, the only shot I could take, so I ended up having to just pull the camera out and make the decision to shoot him. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Yeah, you did. You dropped him. He's down. He's down. You <gasps> dropped him. Are you sure? <laughs> yeah. What do you think? <sighs> wow. Nice. 
He's literally gray. I had a, a, a hole. I said, I went to hell. You missed 100 percent shot. Said, okay, shot. I saw him go like this. I was like, Oh, I got him! <laughs> Wait, how far he was he? Like 220, something like that. A range. Yeah. Wow. Looking for the bod? I don't want to stay close to Jeremiah just because of my. Like, <laughs> hey! Do you see him? Where the hell is he? Da -da 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 -da. Big box on run. Oh, I see him. Show us, show us the, Good one. the deer. Good one. Well guys, here we are, day two with Twisted Oaks Hunts, Big Bill in Missouri, and man, it's been exciting. This is the third buck we put down in 48 hours. My friend Sadie Bass, her boyfriend Colby last night, and we're just racking them up here. Hunt Chef's on his way in. I'm on cloud nine. Um, this is my second buck in 48 hours. We tagged out in Kansas um, a day and a half ago. And uh, this is what we live for, for first day and second week, first day or second day or first week gun hunters. Um, pretty cool. It's my first kill with the uh, Precision Arms 28 Nozzler. Um, that's the Dead Fire series, and that's the first one off the line. It was shipped into me yesterday. This deer was a hard shot, as you guys will see on the, the video. Um, I feel very blessed to be sitting here because actually I didn't even know if I was going to get a shot at him. And one doe turned him left about 200 yards out in the timber, picked a hole, and squeezed. And um, I could tell that I hit him right away, and then he actually ran towards me which is the opposite way to chuck, just saying. But I could use some weight. I'm about, I'm about 50 over. Too many donuts. Stay tuned. We're not done yet. Gun season just warming up. And as always, thanks for watching.